everybody, Ross here. I uh, just got off the phone with one of my clients and we were talking about a visit he just took to Stanford. And on his own official, he got the opportunity to meet with an academic advisor. So we talked a little bit and I said, okay, great. How did the meeting go? What did the academic advisor say? What questions did you ask the academic advisor? So, well, not many. They just kind of told me what majors they have and what a lot of the kids in the team do and um, a little bit about the school. And I said, okay. So first things first, if you meet with an academic advisor, you need to have questions prepared. When they say everything they say and then after 10 minutes say, do you have any questions? You need to say, yes, I do have some questions. And here they are. Just ask some general questions, whether it's about your major, whether it's about help with class, whether it's about you know how much classes you need to take to be eligible, summer school. There's a million questions you can ask. So have a few questions written down. Now, most importantly, after you meet with the academic advisor, get their business card, follow up with an email the following day, and let them know it was great to meet them and thank you for the info. You want to do this for two reasons. The first reason is... If you send an email to the academic advisor thanking them, they will then tell the coach, hey, just so you know, I got a really nice email from Mark. I was you know, appreciating the time we visited. So what that does is it tells the coach now that you know, you're a good player, but you're also a good student and you're a good person. And many academic advisors meet with kids and they never get a thank you email. They never get anything from the kids thanking them for their time. So it's going to help you with the coach that is recruiting you if you send a thank you email to the academic advisor. The second thing is bigger. If you end up going to that school, this academic advisor you met with is going to really, really, really help you when you're in college. The academic advisors know how to get you in and out of classes. They know which professors are easier, which professors are harder. They can help you, help you make your schedule. They can help you with picking your major. So it's somebody that you're going to want to be close with when you get to college. So if you ever meet with an academic advisor when you're taking an unofficial or an official visit, don't miss this opportunity to follow up with them, thank them, build a relationship with them, because you never know. This person might end up helping you very much when you go to college.